welcome to the WIHS Journal. On today's broadcast, we'll learn about a singles dance. That's coming up February 16th. That's taking place at the Casa Maria on the Green in Rocky Hill, Connecticut, in the WIHS studios with me. I was blessed to have the singles leaders from the Apostles' House, prophetess Thomasita Artist and Lisa Walters. Join us today in the broadcast for all the details. And at the part of the ministry, SALT, I love the acronym when you guys told me the, the acronym of that. Either one of you want to explain what the acronym is? Just You guys can kind of take, because they're all here in the studio, we like four sisters in the studio, so it's going to get loud. <laughs> yes. So, and, and anyone who wanted to explain what it is? Yes. SALT is single, the acronym single and living truth. Mm. And mm. we are the salt of the earth and salt is a preservative. Mm. And God is preserved. His word is preserved through us. So we are single and we're living truth and we hold up um, a standard yes. as serving the Lord. Amen. So yes. tell us what church you guys are from. We're from the Apostles' House in the city of Hartford, where Apostles Apostle Dr. Susan Howard. So I'm so excited you guys are going to be having a night of fellowship, dancing, laughter, and good food, and exclamation point. So tell us all about it. First of all, I want to know, is this the first time you're doing a singles event, or this is a consecutive event? Actually, no, this isn't our first event. Um, we've had a different um, events throughout the year, but this is our kickoff for the new year. Okay. Um, we're the new singer leaders um, starting out this year. So we did a kickoff a few weeks ago. We had a luncheon, and this is our event where we wanted to build and to just encourage singles that it's okay to be single. Mm -hmm. It's okay to have fun and enjoy God and enjoy each other and enjoy the fellowship and get built through networking working and events. Absolutely. And it's going to be at a very classy event. Yes. Maybe Lisa, you want to talk about that? Yes, it's going to be at the Casa Mia on the Green. That is going to be at 600 Cold Springs Road in Rocky Hill, Connecticut. So we look forward to that. And the event starts it's February 16th, and it starts at 7 p.m. Yes. The cost is $40 per person. An amazing event. And I see it's formal, which is awesome. Mm -hmm. Everyone's going to be dressed up, men and women together, fellowship and unity. Do you guys have a theme this year, what you're thinking, what you want God to do through it? A theme picked out? Actually, our theme for our minute, for the singles ministry is that we become separate. We know who we are. We become unique and that we become whole in Christ to know who we are so that when God sends us our Boaz, that we're prepared. We, we don't go into a relationship or marriage with baggage, but we're whole in Christ. So that is our um, that is our vision for our ministry. Okay. So Lisa, maybe you can tell, what will you guys focus on when they come in the door? Everyone's going to be dressed up, formal. What will take place when they come in and before they leave? Talk about the agenda that's scheduled. You know, first it's going to be fellowship. It's going to be games. People are going to get to know one another. So it's going to be interactive. We're going to have giveaways. And like I said, the dancing, we're going to have a time where we're going to be talking to them and sharing things and sharing truth about being single. Yes. That's going to be exciting. What you guys do in the singles ministry, how do you encourage the singles here in Connecticut and Massachusetts and New York? I think you kind of, do you kind of minister all around there too? Those yeah. that want to come. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. It's wonderful because a lot of times you think you're alone and you're not alone. Just because you're by yourself, you are not alone. You have value. You matter. And a lot of times you you can feel like, OK, I'm, I'm kind of forgotten. You're feeling some kind of way and you're not. So when we come together and you're like, wait a minute, you're single. I'm single. We're having a good time. We're enjoying each other. We're laughing. We're sharing and we're getting to know one another. So it's not about being isolated, but it's about coming together and really strengthening, encouraging one another, because iron truly does sharpen iron. So when we come together, if we come together, we can grow together and also going through different circumstances, going through different situations that we can discuss it. Because a lot of times when people go through things, even in a single, they think they're by themselves and they're actually not. Amen. I love to hear that. So dancing, music, food, let's talk about what kind of DJ, what kind of food 
Yeah. <laughs> Actually, the food is going to be penny alla vodka. We're going to have a nice fresh salad. Um, there's going to be chicken marsala, stuffed filet of sole, um, sort of cookies, coffee, tea. And then there's going to be an Italian DJ on site. Okay. So what kind of music? Any kind of music you guys can dance to? Yes. It'll yes. be a mixture yes. of, mix yeah. of mm-hmm. music. Yes. I love when singles, you know, conjure up these beautiful events, thinking up, you know, to to encourage the singles. What would be your hope that God would do in every single woman or man that does come to this singles event? To be strengthened, to leave in a different way, to view being single, not something to be looked at, to be sad about, but to view it as some part of your journey. Some may desire to stay single, but those who don't, it's a wonderful journey as you're learning, as you're going through it. But I I believe that they can leave there and being like, I'm single and I'm glad about it. It's not a dead end. It's not the the last street on that road that you really don't want to go on. It's not full of rocks. (laughs) It's smooth. Being single can be like being at the beach and and hearing the waves in the water. You can still be refreshed. You can still grow. God can still use you. You're still a seed. Hallelujah. And you can grow in this beautiful and you've got a fragrance Mm. that God smells. It's not just the married people that matter. All of us matter. You're definitely not going to leave the way you came. Amen. We didn't know we had a preacher here in the studio today. (laughs) Oh, yeah. So if you are uh, tuning in right now, I'm speaking uh, to the singles group. We are speaking right now to Thomasita and Lisa, and they are from the Apostles' House, and they are talking about a singles event coming up at the Casa Maria in Rocky Hill. So, so excited about that. And I know you guys, you said you do the SALT, which is the name of your singles group. Tell us some of the things that singles men or women they do struggle with some of the things that we came across um our first event our kickoff um people were struggling with the fact of being alone um and the struggle of not knowing how to date as a christian um when you transfer over and you know we have the worldly dating but to transfer over when you're keeping yourself for god and your focus is on living for god is totally different and so some of their struggle is what do i do how do i keep busy how do i not focus on being alone and then how do i change my perspective of dating from a worldly perspective to a godly perspective yes that's Oh, that's an awesome view. Now, do you guys ever preach about sometimes you pray and then you ask God for a confirmation about what he wants for you? Because sometimes look at the Apostle Paul. But yes. Do you ever say that and you ask God for a confirmation what he would do in your life? Do you ever think about in that point of view? Absolutely. We believe that you can pray and ask God what his perspective is to give you confirmation, but to also make sure that that confirmation aligns with God's word, because sometimes in your carnal, in your flesh, you can desire something so bad that the enemy will send a counterfeit that Mm. looks exactly like what you wanted confirmation for. Mm. And so to discern it, but to align it with the word of God, to make sure that it's not only confirmed with your flesh, but it's also confirmed with the word of God. We're talking about this amazing singles event, which I hope is going to be packed out and sold out. So let's talk about maybe some details that you would like to convey to our listeners. Like we said, we we know it's semi-formal. We know we're going to have a great time. But just come and expect the unexpected. Mm. Don't think you know what's going to happen. Don't think you know how it's going to go. Just come and just be open to have a wonderful time. Yes. Yes. So you guys are seasoned veterans in the Lord. I can completely see that. <laughs> so you have been doing single things for a while. Just maybe one of you anointed ladies want to talk about again when, where, and how they can find out how to get tickets and to get in contact with you. We have a website, www.theapostleshouse.net. And we also have a cash app, which is dollar sign TAH131. And they can put in the memo portion SALT Mm. 216. Okay. So that's, they'll know that that's for the singles. And, um, and like we said, we it's semi-formal and Casa Mia on the green. And that's, uh, that's, it's a beautiful place. They're going to really enjoy it. They've got plenty of parking, which is also <laughs> always wonderful. And when you, know, you know what I love about it? It's right mm-hmm. near Valentine's Day. Yes. Absolutely. Yes. 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 Absolutely. And, and that's a time when a lot of, of singles get down. Yes. Because it's a time when you're feeling like, okay, I feel like I'm left out. I feel like I don't matter. It's, mm-hmm. it, you know, I don't get any, I'm not getting any candy. I'm not getting 
getting any <laughs> flowers. So you start feeling some kind of way. So you can come together and you don't have to feel any kind of way. You can come together and have a great time and be around singles and just feel great about it. Once again on the broadcast with me was the singles directors from the Apostles House in Hartford, Connecticut. That was prophetess Tomasita artist and Lisa Walters talking about the singles dance taking place February 16th for a night of fellowship, food, and dancing that's taking place at the Casa Maria on the Green in Rocky Hill, Connecticut. For more details, you can give us a call at 860-346-1049. I'm going to support Chelly for news and public affairs.